Hello, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Rudy and thank you so much for being here. Today's video is a highly requested one and it is so exciting because we are talking about all things about Face. About Face is a makeup brand created by the artist Halsey and it has gotten so much buzz recently. I have been using their products since they came out. I have so many favorites and we are going to talk about every single one because by the time this video goes live, you will now be able to shop About Face at Ulta Beauty. Yay! This video is sponsored by About Face Beauty, which is incredible. I can't believe they even noticed me. It means a lot to me and being on the Ulta Beauty Collective, being able to work with another brand that is joining the Ulta Beauty team, it is amazing. I don't know about you, but this seemed like the literal perfect match for me. Like About Face and Ulta, just makes sense. Like the pricing, the the products, like everything about it really jived with me. Jove, joved with me. <laughs> if you don't know who Halsey is, she is an incredibly popular singer songwriter. She's also an artist and a writer. Her music is incredible. I have loved her for a very long time. She really gets me in my feels. And I feel like she's just a very authentic person, an artist, which totally makes sense with this line and the vibe of this line. There are options for everyone in this line. And that's something that I really want to nail that point home today. Because if you look at this face of makeup, you probably would not assume off the bat that it is from About Face because you're used to seeing these really bright colors, which are amazing and I love from that line. But I I want to highlight the fact that you can also just as easily go way more neutral with these products and achieve a more glowy everyday makeup look that lasts all day long. If there is anything that I would say about these products, it is that they are pigmented and long lasting, but easy to use. And that is incredibly rare to find in a makeup brand. Usually it's one or the other. They're super pigmented, they're hard to blend, or they're easy to blend, but the pigment goes nowhere. These are the perfect matchup of those two things. If you are a makeup beginner and you want something more vibrant, more long lasting, more pigmented, you have got to test out this brand. In addition, they are vegan and cruelty free and the fact that they are available at Ulta Beauty now makes them more accessible for more people. They actually recently dropped their prices to make the makeup accessible for more people. So really, I am all about about face. So if you wanna learn about their matte eye paints, their lip products, their highlight, their eyeshadow primer. I mean, we're talking about it all. We're gonna put it on our face. We're gonna do a step-by-step -step look, then keep watching and don't forget to subscribe. Okay, so starting out here, I do have on a skin tint, concealer, bronzer, blush. I'll have all of that linked in the description below, but I just kind of did everything that I could that isn't on my current table. I feel like we should start with our highlighter. So this is the Light Lock Highlighting Fluid, first of all. Can we talk about this packaging? I mean, this is absolutely stunning. I love how intricate and cute all of her packaging is. I have mine in the shade Shaken or Stirred. And let me tell you, this highlighter is insane. <laughs> there are four shades. I have the second shade that is like the most gold. This is like a scene from space highlight. This is $18. Again, you can find this on the Ulta website. The benefits that are listed are molten crystalline highlighting fluid, delivers an intense amount of pearls for max illumination, lightweight, buildable, long wearing, water resistant. This is absolutely correct. I will show you guys later in this video. Yesterday when I was trying out a few of her new products, including this and two eyeliners that are not at Ulta yet, but I'm sure they will be soon. I was fully rubbing my eyes in my face in the shower and it was not budging. Like this stuff is the definition of long wear. So I'm gonna show you a little bit of a swatch. This comes in a dropper. You will literally never run out of this stuff, but I wanna show you just how intense this highlighting fluid is. Like, are you kidding me? That is the definition of gold. Shimmery, sheen, highly pigmented, very lightweight and thin, like feels like almost nothing on the skin, but gives you an insane glow and an insane amount of pigment. This is sort of a lot for me. You guys know I'm more of like an everyday kind of makeup girl, but I really like to use my fingers to blend this out on the high points of my face or to mix it in with my products. So mixing it in with your foundations, mixing it in with like a concealer to add more of a lit from 
Within Highlight effect kind of works very, very well, but I will show you directly how I like to use this on the high points of my face today. So I'm gonna drop a little bit on the back of my hand here and basically do what I just did and really get it saturated on my hand so I have just the perfect amount on my finger. And I'm just going to tap this in to where I would normally highlight. And again, you really do not need much and it goes such a long way and lasts all day long. It's insane. Same here on the cheekbones. You can already see that starting to pop in. And I just wanna say, as I've mentioned before, like these are multi-purpose. I know that they look very bold, which they are, but there is ways to use these products in a more everyday makeup minimal look that come out absolutely beautifully. And that is what I am here to show you. So again, tapping in with my fingers. This is also a highlight that allows you to move it around for some time after you've put it down. So I like that. It's not going to set in place in within seconds of you putting it on. It's gonna allow you to put it where you want to. And again, look how much I still have left on my hand here. I'm gonna put this on the cupid's bow. I mean, look at that. I mean, that is a glowing goddess. Of course, they have shades for every skin tone. They have a shade lighter than this for more fair skin and a couple shades darker. It's just really gorgeous and I never hear anyone talking about this, so I wanted to definitely bring this up. Look how much I still have left. You can use this on the decollete, on the shoulders to give yourself a little bit of that like summery glow. It's gonna dry down. It's not gonna stay like sticky and it just, Mm, it's gorgeous. I personally love a, like a really gold color on my shoulders, so it's perfect. It will last you forever. And oh my God, I just got it everywhere. I'm gonna look like the Tin Man. Oh my God. For $18, you will legitimately never run out of this and you can always amp it up to be more of a crazy highlight if you want. Or again, like I did, you can tap it in for a more subtle effect. So I've pretty much got my base done here and I'm looking so snatched. So let's talk about some of the eye products that I have and then we'll go into lips. I don't even know how to begin to describe how much I love the matte fluid eye paints. These are the best, the best matte cream eyeshadows on the market. Full stop, full stop. These are incredible. They are pigmented, creamy, easy to blend, set down, give you time to blend, beautiful blown out eyes. They keep the color that you actually want. So for example, this green color, this is obviously not my vibe every single day, but if it was my vibe and I wanted this color all over my eyes, this is the color that I would get. Not a light streaky version, not something, no. They have said, this is the color you want, this is what you're gonna get. I don't know how they've done it, but I am so, impressed and i have talked about my favorite shade from this line in the shade capulets i use this all the time it is my favorite liquid eyeshadow i use it when i travel i use it for date nights i use it for daily because you can really build it up to get the pigment that you want this is like my perfect nude color and again i wanted to mention even though there are you know the full rainbow in this line which i absolutely love there are also more neutral shades that you can pick up and test out so don't be afraid to try these and these are 16 dollars absolutely well worth your money they are so easy to use and I will show you now. I am going to do most of my lid with this color and then we're gonna talk a little bit about another eyeshadow that I love from them. But let me just show you how easy this is. I will put on about that much and take a fluffy brush. Any fluffy brush will do, honestly. This is just a random one. And windshield wiper that in the crease and on the lid and you suddenly have a perfectly blown out eyeshadow as if you had done this for hours. It's perfect. It's so easy. I do want to mention, like, as you noticed, I did not wear an eyeshadow primer underneath that. I personally don't feel like I need to if I'm just going out and about throughout the day. If I really, really want these shadows to last all freaking night, like if I was in a wedding, I would totally use their eyeshadow primer. So this is the Shade Fix, and this is in the smoothing one. This is an amazing eyeshadow primer. It just has a little bit of like a nudie skin tone shade 
that you can apply directly to the eye and use underneath any of the About Face products. And it just helps the color last a little bit longer and show up a little bit more boldly. I'll pop in a picture that they have on the website to show you how different of an effect you can get from this primer. The primer is also available at Ulta and it is $13. So if you are a person who likes really bold, long wearing eyeshadow, I would consider adding that as well. Again, I'll link it down below. And if I wasn't talking, this would be done in five seconds. I'm not even kidding. I have another get ready with me where I'm using this shade on a date night and it's just incredible. Add this one to cart if you are looking for that everyday gorgeous sort of mauvey brown to give you that I've done my makeup. It's taken me forever to blend, but it actually took 20 seconds. And I also love knowing that if I wanted to do a bold look, which sometimes I do, like if I'm going to a concert or I'm going out, I have all of these colorway options. I mean, look at this. They're incredible. I love the colors that they've chosen and the vibrancy of the colors. You can also mix them together to create your own color. They have a white and a black option to lighten or darken any of the shades. And I think I really want to try out the next one in On Point. Honestly, let's just... Let's just put a little bit in the inner corner. Why not? Look at this pink. Are you kidding me? I also love the packaging. It's like so satisfying. Okay, let's just put a little bit in the inner corner. I mean, look at that. When they say pastels, they mean it, which I love because again, like this is the easiest, most blendable eyeshadow I've ever tried. And it just sort of lightened up that front part of my eye without being too crazy. I I'm so freaking impressed with these. And there is a reason that they have gone viral and it's because they are incredibly easy to use. If you're gonna pick up anything from this video, let it be some of these matte eye paints. They're incredible. But if you are not a matte person, another contender that I wanna talk to you about are the About Face Shadow Sticks. There are currently 10 shades of the Shadow Sticks on Ulta's website. These are $14 each. I love these. I love these equally, maybe a tiny bit less than the matte paints, but they're amazing. If you are the type of person who just wants an easy look, wants it to be blendable, but maybe you're looking for more of like a shimmer or a satin finish, these are your girls. First of all, I will say that I had owned these two shades for over a year. I bought these two shades when Halsey released her makeup line because I was so excited for the different colors that they had. And as you can see, there are sort of matching shades within the matte paints as well. A lot of her colors coexist together, which I really like because you can do a multi-finish look with similar colors. So these have been some of my favorites for a while. This is in the shade Baroque and Acidic. I get questions about this green one in Acidic all the time. I use it on my waterline, but we're not really going for that sort of look today. But I did want to mention that the bright shades of these are just as good as the Everyday Neutral Girlies which I have a feeling you guys are gonna be more interested in. So I have Lotus Leaf and Miracle Mimosa here, and I think I'm going to use these as my inner corner and my uh, brow highlight today. But I also have the shades Actual Ambrosia and Dream Syndicate. These are darker, a little bit more of like a smoky eye finish. These two together would be perfect for a smoky eye. It's like that, oh, are you kidding me? It's like that beautiful kind of shimmery taupe shade and then more of like a starry black with a tiny bit of glitter. Look at these. Like that is the taupe of my dreams. And I think if you kind of did some blendy blendy with these, it gives you time. It's gonna create like a beautiful smoky eye. I'm gonna have to try that later. But today I am doing more of a lightweight look because I know that's what most of you guys are here for. So I wanna show you again that you can absolutely achieve that look and have it be long lasting while using about face. So let's look at these two more highlighter pigmented shades. One is a little bit more of like a champagne pearl and one is more straight up gold. I'm always looking for like the brightest inner corner that I can find and this may be it. So this more goldy shade is in Miracle Mimosa and the lighter shade is in Lotus Leaf. I really like these both. I think I'm gonna try Miracle Mimosa for my inner corners today though. I kind of like that goldish tone to it. Also wanted to mention on the back of these there is a little sharpener. They twist up here and then you can sharpen it if you like to have a sharper tip. And I'm gonna use this in the inner corner. Woo! You can also be really precise with these because they are a pencil and have a sharpened tip. And I'm just gonna take this up here even though I already have highlight up there. And just kind of blend it out with my finger because it is, again, one of those products that gives you time to play with it before it sets down. 
I would say this one is the least long lasting of them all. It still lasts a long time, but the matte eye paints and the highlighter are like non-budging. You could also easily use the shadow sticks as highlighters for your face too, especially these more like gold ones. I think they would look absolutely beautiful and again would give you more of like a pinpointed look. But I just feel like that is the most perfect sort of nude eye that's gonna last me all day. And trust me, it will. And I know this because I wore these yesterday and it was like 100 degrees out. <laughs> See, look, it's been a couple minutes here. They've kind of set down. They're still a little bit movie, but these things are gonna last all day. Okay, so we have covered eyes. I'm gonna add some mascara and do my brows and then we'll finish off with the lips and you don't wanna miss it, trust me. We're back, we're fresh faced, finishing up with the lips. I wanna say there are three, I think three products, yes, that um, About Face offers on Ulta's website. All of them are great, but today I really wanna focus on the Light Lock Lip Gloss because I have not seen anybody talk about these. The two that I have seen people talk about are the Painted Matte Lip Colors, which are kind of sisters to the Painted Matte eye colors and then there is the matte fix lip pencils which we're going to use today with the gloss if you are interested in more of a matte lip color these are 16 dollars. they have 10 shades on the ulta website you can tell they have a little bit of a different packaging because the outside structure is clear whereas the eyeshadows have fully opaque packaging but it is the same doe foot applicator they are so pigmented, this is in the shade. Baby's Arms, which is my favorite one. It is like this beautiful sort of peachy nude, stunning. They have tons of shades, all different types of skin tones. Look at this bright orange shade. I have to try that for summer, but today we're doing more of like an all over nude look. So we're gonna skip that, but just know if you are looking for a comfortable matte lipstick, not a liquid lipstick, but like a matte lipstick, Try those, amazing. Same with the lip pencils. They're matte, they long. They matte, they long. They're matte, they're long lasting. Like, I don't know how many times I can say that about this brand. They're long lasting products. They have 10 options on the Ulta website. These are $12, which in my opinion is a steal. These are my favorite shades. These more like, you know, nudie pink shades. But today we are using the shade Momentary Bliss. And on top, we are using the Light Lock Lip Glosses. This is in the shade Playdate. Again, these are on the Ulta website and these are really, really unique. I'm trying to find a free space on my hand. They have that pigment that the other products have, but obviously since it's a gloss, it's gonna give you more of that sheen. This shade is literally perfect. Like this is the most perfect nudie brown shade for a lip gloss I've ever seen. I would say these feel sort of like a mix between a gloss and an oil. They're not really sticky at all. They're very, very thin. So you could easily layer the matte lip colors over the glosses if you wanted to. I'm just wanting a more glossy look today because it's super hot out and I don't wanna deal with multiple layers on the lips. So I'm gonna go in with these two products. Also wanted to mention the Light Lock lip glosses are on Ulta's website for $13. Okay, I can't talk because I'm going to mess up. So hold please. <laughs> That took me no time at all. They're super creamy, very easy to use. You do need to use a sharpener with these because they're like an actual pencil and not a roll up. And I find that these kinds, like the ones that have an actual pencil tip, tend to last longer. I don't know what it is about that, but I just feel like that's true. And here is a close up of the shade Momentary Bliss. I'm just gonna kind of drag this in a little bit with my fingers because I want the gloss to kind of sit on top. Okay, let's do this. I mean, that's stunning. That color combo is summer in a tube. Super duper lightweight, like literally, you can rub your lips together. It's not gonna give you that like ring in the center of your mouth. It looks like my lips, but better. It doesn't really have like a cooling effect or a plumping effect. It's pretty much just a straight up, very lightweight, thin, layerable gloss, but gives you a good moment of big pigmentation, especially paired with the lip pencils. So here is my final look using almost all About Face products, and I love it. And I bet you would not assume that this was an About Face look because I think a lot of people just associate these bright colors, but I'm telling you guys, you can easily do a long lasting, really more neutral colored look with these products just as easily. I think my favorites, as I mentioned, 
are the matte eye paints. They're just absolutely stunning. If you can find a few shades that you like that are in stock, I highly recommend picking them up and playing with them and just like getting creative and seeing what looks you can come up with. Thank you again to About Face for sponsoring this video. This was so fun. I am happy to answer any questions that you guys have in the comments about about face or these products and you can shop all of these in my description below and i will see you guys in the next video really soon bye